mind state. This is how romantic our, 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 our household is. We found ourselves there. I imagine you've got like, you know, roses uh, from your lovely lady here. She's got loads of roses and you've got him pants and you've got, you know, just misery and tears because you're alone in the world. But I, I go out with a man who absolutely, I know, a man, surprising. Uh, <laughs> Bisexual, least popular of all the sexualities. <laughs> it really is. Like, like even my best friend, I'll be going around her to dinner and she'll be like, Izzy, is there anything you don't eat? I'm oh, no, sorry, you're bisexual, you eat anything. <laughs> <laughs> but I got given this book, yeah, sexy book times, right? This is called Brief Lives and it's by John Aubrey, who was mental, right? <laughs> now, John Aubrey, I, I, I really I really adore this man. He was described by his contemporaries, right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, this is gonna be, I think we're gonna get us in the micro now. Now, now we're, we move beyond stand-up into learning. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yeah, um, John Aubrey, right, um, this is, he basically, like, he was a geographer, so I love him already because I'm a geographer, and geography's cool because, you know, Oxbow Lakes, boom, right? <laughs> but, and so, but he was also where right, he used to collect information on people who were, sort of, like, alive slash dead around his lifetime, and just collect the information. He was going to make a big book, but never really did. His contemporaries described him as, he was a shiftless person, roving and maggoty headed <laughs> which, which is awesome, sometimes a little better than crazed. So what he did was he would write, like literally they went through his papers and he'd like write in the little corners of things going, oh this is what somebody said about this guy, this is what somebody said about her, and oh look at this guy. And this book is filled with like, and there's the famous people in here, Christopher Wren is in here, right? Nothing about his architecture. <laughs> Obviously, something else put in order for him, by the way. <laughs> right, but it's things like Dr. Christopher Wren has put a trick on us, as it seems, for he made himself a year younger than he indeed is. He <laughs> lied about his age, Christopher Wren. Boom. <laughs> 27. 20, okay. <laughs> 